Today wrapped up an emotional week of witness testimony in the hearing for Major Nadal Malik Hassan. The 40-year-old soldier is accused of killing 13 and injuring 32 others in the shooting rampage at Fort Hood last November. Nearly 30 witnesses have testified so far. Most are victims. KXAN's Jared Wise has more. Today I sit in the courtroom just feet away from Major Hassan, wheeled in by a law enforcement officer. He sat in his wheelchair, barely moving, occasionally scratching his head, and once again, he stared directly at all of the soldiers that testified. Some glared right back. The first witness today explained to the defense how he actually took cell phone video of the shooting rampage as it was happening. He said he was ordered by his senior officer to delete the video. Three other witnesses gave their testimony via satellite from Afghanistan. Specialist Magan Martin said, He began shooting in a fan motion. I laid as still as I possibly could because he was shooting everything that moved. She later said, It was a nightmare that reoccurs every day. Captain Melissa Kale broke down in tears as she described how she tried to save her close friend. I tried to pull Sergeant Kruger with me. I was unable to pull her. She didn't move. As testimony wrapped up for the day, six other soldiers describe how they survived the attack, some being shot multiple times. Sergeant Sean Manning, who was shot five times, said, I had to play dead because I thought he might finish me off. And witness testimony will continue on Monday as more soldiers are expected to take the stand. Reporting at Fort Hood, Jared Wise, KXAN, Austin News.